200 years ago, there was an industrial revolution. Even young children worked in the coal mines and ironworks. It was very, very dangerous work. The men who dug the canal were called navigators. They say a good navigator could dig up to 23 tons in a single day. Horses were used to pull boats along the canal. Before this, people used horses and carts. Canals were much better for the transport of timber, coal and limestone. The use of canal boats and horses was more cost efficient because it replaced the work of 200 horses and the goods arrived at the destination much quicker. Locks enabled boats to go up and downhill. You needed a special key called a swan neck windlass to operate the locks. Canals were too expensive to be built everywhere. Tram roads connected towns to canals. Men and horses worked together as a team to carry ton after ton of industrial goods. In 1800, the population of Newport was less than a thousand people. Newport became an important place because of the Industrial Revolution. People moved there because they wanted a job. The population grew quickly. By the 1930s, canals were hardly used for carrying goods, so people used them for leisure instead. Believe it or not, people started swimming in the canal. Even though it was against the law, they still did it. It was very dangerous to swim in the canal, especially in the locks. In time, the locks and the canal became overgrown and disused. People forgot about them. In places, the canal has been replaced by roads. Today, things are very different. There has been restoration at 14 locks. And the dream is to reopen the canal again.